It's a different type of daily. Stay tuned. Hey y'all, welcome or welcome back to my channel, Planning Serenity, where we plan for serenity. My name is Jessica, and as mentioned, we are going to do a different type of daily page. So, if you are new here, I appreciate you clicking on my video and stopping by. If you are returning, you already know how I feel about you. So, if you are new here, uh, this is the Hello Gorgeous Volume 3 Planner by Kristen over at Luxbook. Um, and this is a goals page. I have been obsessed with this page. Um... For the longest, I just never knew how to use it. Um, I, as y'all know, don't do goals. I'm not like a goals person. Maybe when I grow up <laughs> one day in the future, I will get into, you know, goals and all that good stuff. But in my head, there's like stuff that needs to get done and I just need to get it done by a certain day. Like I don't, yeah. Um, so I, as y'all saw, just covered up the goals header um, and I'm just gonna use it for like a daily page. For a daily page and hopefully it comes out cute. So. Today, y'all, we're not using Pinterest stickers. I know, I know, like what is happening? But <laughs> we are going to use, um, we're going in, what? We're going into my main sticker book um, and we are gonna use these by Pretty Girl Plans Co. So as y'all know, it takes me forever to put my stickers on the, the actual template that comes with the sticker book. So if you're new here, this is a um, digital sticker book by Kristen. Y'all know everything Lux book over here, but this is a digital sticker by book by her. And when you are importing your stickers, they do go on one of these templates. However, it just takes me 40 days and nights to get them over to the template. I just, I just be on the move. It ain't nobody got time for that. So, um, when I first started using the digital sticker books, I was very adamant about putting them on the templates and then organizing the index and all that good stuff. But now like, the way my brain works, there's no need for me to do it. Um, but I would like to, well, there's no need for me to really do the index, but I would like to start transferring over the stickers to the template again. Anyway, now that that spiel is out of the way, these are by Pretty Girl Plans. Um, and this is, I forget what collection this is. Um, I think it's something to do with widgets or something or every day or something. I don't know, but we're going to use this daily reminder sticker and we're just going to place it in here where it says photo and I'm just going to blow it up to where it's right in. Wow, these fit perfectly. So y'all know with some squares, you either have to make them shorter or wider. Look how perfect that fits in there. Like, are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? All right, um, we're going to skip that one for now because I think there's a certain photo I want to go in there, but <laughs> I'm not going to put it in there just yet. Um, ooh, let's grab a quote of the day. Let's put the quote like over here, maybe. These may move around once I zoom out. Y'all know if I'm zooming in and working, it's hard to see what it really looks like. I love that. All right, let's grab what else? Um, these are all part of the same collection. Ooh, I kind of like this as a header. It says, get it done, babe. You got this. And obviously this is a daily, so it'll be a pretty busy day. Let's, oopsies, let's throw that up here. That did that because that's where the goals is that I covered. Um, now y'all know I like my font text short and wide. So honestly, I want it real dainty and minimal like that. And we'll see how that looks once I put everything else on the page. All right, we'll leave that there for now, just so I know that that's what I want to use. Um, what else? Oh, let's grab this one. So this one has, oopsies, this one has, here, let's see, um, AM and PM, the date, and then you can highlight the day, a task list, and then a blank box. I love that. So, oh, this is gonna be so perfect for a daily. Now, last year I probably would be adding like flowers all around or like peeking out peekaboo here and there, but I am a very, very minimal planner this year slash moody editorial if you're new here. Uh, my planning style has changed drastically from last year. Um, and I'm loving it now. If I were to add it, like, I'm getting ahead of myself, okay? Because <laughs> now I'm like, hmm, maybe flowers wouldn't be so bad, but I'm not going to do it. Okay, let's grab something for that bottom square. I think there's like a, yeah, let's grab this. Um, It's just like dots, dots. What are these dotted 
dotted note pages, I guess you can say. Um, so we're just going to put that in this square so I have some extra space for all the deets and stuff. Um, something needs to go there. But let's grab that other picture. So everything that I'm using, actually, let's grab the quote. So these are by Kezuku Designs. Hmm. I do want this one, but I'm going to crop that off, um, crop the top off. So it says note to self. You don't have to be good enough for people to love you. You be good and be <laughs> good enough for yourself for you to love you. I love. But since this already says quote of the day, I'm just going to crop note to self out. And then we're going to fit that in here. And y'all know I love my text stickers short and wide, but I actually think that looks pretty good like that. Oh my gosh. What is happening? Who are you? No Pinterest stickers, a tall and skinny text quote. Like what? Okay. I think that's cute. Or do we want it a little wider? Or do we want it a little shorter? <laughs> now I'm getting like shorter like I typically do it. Um, But it's still taller than it was. Okay. That's cute. All right. For here, I've only used this sticker like once before. <laughs> No offense to anyone, but I absolutely love this sticker. So, um, again, these are by Pretty Girl Plans Co. And whenever I use sticker shops, they're always linked down below. All right, so this doesn't fit perfectly. As I said, those do. Well, as y'all saw, those did. So, um, and that's what I mean when, like, squares do not always fit perfectly in squares. Um, super cute. Oh, I love that. <laughs> All right, we're actually going to add something to that. I think, is it on here or is it on? No, it's on something else I favorited. This one? Oh, actually, let's grab this tab while we're here. Um, to bring that gold and black in, I think that's why I favorited this. I'm going to put this tab here. And I'm gonna put it on the right side, I think, because I think it'll look weird under that. Yeah, that looks weird. So, super cute. We'll put it on the right side, just touching the black. Oh my gosh, I'm loving this, I'm loving this. All right, let's, um, there's something I wanted to grab for this. I thought I favorited it. Oh yeah, because it's a part of the same set. So it says, just saying. Um, and literally that just saying and not y'all <laughs> not y'all whatsoever but y'all know life is always lifening lifening life is always lifening um so yeah we're just gonna put that there all right i'm just trying to size this as the tr as a train goes by 20 miles away like i don't understand well it's probably not 20 miles but i don't understand like I don't even know where that track is that we're always hearing it, honestly, because we don't live near train tracks. Like, so why am I always hearing a train? Okay. I'm trying to see how, what size I want this. It's just like a little accent to this photo. All right, yeah. Mm -hmm. Hmm, I was gonna make it skinnier, but I kind of like that thickness. Yes, I have, <laughs> I have like 10 cleaning cloths out over here. So if you see color switching, I don't know what color I used before, but yeah, here we find ourselves. Okay, I think that's cute. So I'm gonna obviously for the day that I use this, fill in all of this stuff, extra space down here. I love how this turned out. Now, again, last year I probably would have added like flowers popping out, probably like here, here, and here for symmetry or maybe like bottom or I don't know, but I'm loving this minimal vibe. If anything, I was gonna say I'll put a black tab here, but since I have a black tab here, let's see what it would look like. Um, and not saying it would be this black tab, but I'm just grabbing it just to see because y'all know like without my bottom black line, I feel like so lost. <laughs> All right. Um, no, I don't, yeah, no. Unless I like create my own black line, I don't think I like that. Okay, let's actually copy, paste, crop. Let's get the shadow out. Let's turn it sideways. Hmm. 
Maybe. Maybe. And I grabbed that the screenshot of that because I like that texture, although you can't really see the texture. Oh, you can. Oh, I love that. I love that. All right, we're about to just start creating our own bottom black lines and it looks kind of dope with the black and white, which y'all know is my planning style. So I love this daily. Oh, if you are new here and you made it to the end of the video, I genuinely appreciate you. Please drop a black heart in the comments if you are new. And if you like what you're seeing, a like and subscribe would be absolutely awesome. Y'all, I'm literally loving this. If you are returning, drop a purple heart in the comments. Like this video as well. And I will see all y'all in tomorrow's video. 